What's up, duelists? It's Nerp here, and wow, it's been a long time since I last made a video. Um, a month ago, actually. And I'm sorry about that, but school started, I haven't had much free time, and I've had less of an interest in playing Duelist. Um, so what's going on? Uh, I just kind of ran into this in recording, I didn't really check like the forums or any updates. I don't know what's new from the looks of it, the menu screen looks pretty uh, like the same. Um, I don't know if less people are playing now, um, or more people are playing now. Uh, is the game being advertised? Is it getting more popular? I have no idea. Um, yeah, so I did uh, play one game last night, make sure I still knew how to play the game. Um, and yeah, so I got to zero in July, and then August I didn't really do much, and then September I just won one ranked match. So I am 1-0 since coming back. I don't know how, I'm go how much I'm going to play in the future. I do have a spirit orb, I guess I'll do it, just because I have it. I don't know why I have that. Um, ooh. Uh, so a Vindicator, it's a legendary. Really good for magma. Alright, um, let's see. Let me just... Ooh, crafting, let's disenchant extra. So I have a bunch of spirits, so I could make my decks better, but I don't think there's enough resources out there for the game right now to have optimal decks. Magmar, another... That's my first Silithar. And where's the Vindicator? Here's the Vindicator. Um, I think I'm just gonna go, since I'm getting back into it, I'm just gonna go uh, Lion or what I'm used to playing. Um, so, let's do this. Uh, and me, what I've been doing the past month uh, in my free time, and I have been playing a lot of Minecraft. So, instead of 1.9, I've been playing on a Minecraft Realm server with a bunch of my friends, and it's been really fun. Um, I think things are pretty cool, and I was wondering if you guys wanted me to make a video on it, like just showing it around the Realm server, a tour um, if you want, or even maybe I could make it into somewhat of a series, I don't know. Um, because if Minecraft's the game I'm mainly playing, I don't know, uh, instead of having no videos on the channel, maybe I should uh, post that, or I could just uh, start playing Duelist a lot again, I don't know. Um, and I also have some old, a lot of, I have like three old Minecraft worlds that I've put a lot of time into and I've never really shown them like online so I think I want to get those out there and do like a tour of those so here we are against Chompy never seen that name before maybe he's a different player and so I forgot do I go first or second I think I'm going I don't even remember um, I'm gonna get rid of the Sundar Blixer in case I'm going second. I want to have this Tempest. And I know there is like I think there's a client for Duelist now. Um, and I downloaded it. It's like I, I know there's a client, but I'm not sure if it's like final or anything. I think it's still like uh, in its early stages. I am going first, so I probably should have. I'm gonna get rid of the Tempest then. Oh, pretty good start. Windblade Adept is pretty great. A 4, 3, for 2. So, the client thing, I downloaded it, I uh, opened it, and I mean, it's just like this. It works the same. But the only uh, problem is, it. I don't think it goes in windowed mode, so that kind of is a deal breaker for me. That's really annoying. Mm, get rid of one of these Sundrop Elixirs. Well. It's impossible for me to get on two of these, so I won't. I'm just gonna... And I can give you... So... And I'll keep you alive. Should I put something there so we can't get it? Yeah, I'll put something there so we can't get it. And I'm gonna... 
not bring this guy to four attack. I could bring him to four attack. But then he just die next turn. Maybe I should have done that. He is a button coming tempest, but whatever. Also, maybe I should have left the middle one open because he's still able to get this one. I don't know, I'm a little rusty. And there was a tempest, so I shouldn't have uh, wasted that extra two attack. I could have gotten two more attack. Okay, he is that now. This guy's 16, so he is kind of experienced. Uh, Holy Emulation would be really nice, but I can't exactly play it. Let's see. Let me get rid of the Rock Pulverizer. Another Windblade Adept. He is low on cards. I'm just going to move out and I'm going to place this guy down here. I don't want him to be able to be... Actually, I'm going to put him over here. I just don't want him to be in range of the Silver Guard Squire because I don't want him drawing like a card for not really doing anything. So next turn I'll have what? I'll have five mana, so I can't play Windblade plus Holy Emulation. Um, so that kind of sucks. He plays his own one of those. Um, hmm. I could play this and this, I guess. And I'm gonna get rid of one of the Windblades. Okay, that is useful. Um, I'm trying to like stay away from that so it doesn't get a free card, but I guess it's not really much of a, a big deal if he does. Um, I'm gonna put you down and I will save that. I'm just going to put down a wind blade back here. Okay, that will be my turn, I think. I know I'm playing kind of weird. I'm like, uh, I'm actually in a nice range for him to do a holy emulation, but he needs to play a two drop with it. Yeah, I'm playing like kind of like awkwardly. It's like I'm um, defensive. Almost like a stalemate. I think I have the advantage though, just because I have more powerful creatures than him. Mm. So next turn I can go with a Ephemeral Shroud Holy Immolation and deal four damage to a bunch of things. Um, or, okay, so now he's going to be a little harder to destroy. I'm not too, uh, not too worried about that though. Okay, cool. So they're in the same, okay. They're all in the same, like, holy emulation zone. That is really nice. I can actually bring this guy to 13 attack and damage there. Oh no, this is his guy, right? That is his guy. Uh, can I win? If I were to... I don't think I can win. Well, I would have to uh, unprovoke that. I'm going to have to do that. I can get 13 damage on you. Alright. And that's not enough. Okay, so, let's see, um, I will Holy Immolation, uh, 
Where do I want a holy immolation? I guess over here. I guess I'll attack first. Oh, I should really... Oh, I can't do that too. That kind of sucks. Okay, so I guess I have to do it here. Alright, then I'll holy immolation. And now I will... I'm just gonna go face. I'm gonna dispel that and just hit him hard. And just in case I'll keep myself on back to full. And yeah, then I have an Arc Light Regalia and a Silver Guard Knight. So things are looking good. He's down to 5 health. I'm at 25 health. Um, just a couple Tempests would win the game. He might heal up with these things though. Sundrop elixirs. Sorry if I play. I'm playing slowly right now. Gotta see uh, how you can get back into the groove. What's this? Battle log. That's cool. This shows like what cards have been played. That's nice. You can see like if you miss something, which I often do. He does a holy emulation and it gets all of my guys, which are not the sad one. There's still a good holy immolation. And he draws. Hard. Okay, so this is not over yet. I'm gonna have to find a way to like get to him. Um if I could destroy this that would be good. But you have just enough. Let's see. Uh, I'm gonna I think I'm gonna get rid of the Iron Cliff Guardian. Yeah, because I know what I'm gonna play this turn, I think. Actually, no. I'm gonna get rid of the. No, no, Iron Cliff Guardian. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to. Basically, I'm gonna kill this dude. So I'm going to give you Divine Bond, I'm going to kill that, and then I'm going to move up here, Arclet Regalia, and bring you down to one health, and take no damage back. And I'll heal you up, just because. Alright, and if I have any way of dealing damage to him, I would win. Okay, so we have played another one of those things. I don't really like those things that much because I don't feel like cards are that important in Duelist. Like, you have so many cards from getting two every turn. I mean, they're obviously important, but gaining more cards, you usually don't need that because you already have a lot of cards. Okay, so fine, we're gonna kill each other. But now he has one health, I have 25 health, and uh, a really nice legendary artifact. Zerite Lion, okay, so do I have a way to destroy that Zerite Lion to get to his general? Um, two Arclight Sentinels would work, but I don't have two. I'll keep the Rock Pulverizer, that could help. I should really just go all provoke, right? Um, Arclight Sentinel. I'm gonna. Just keep that though. I need to get rid of the Windblade Adduct. Tempest. That's game. So I can just lower your health and then Tempest to kill it and then move up to kill him. Oh no, that, the Tempest is just gonna kill him. Oh yeah, okay, well. So, win's a win. Oh, this is new. A report button. Well, Chompy was. Oh, look, wait, why are we still gaining levels? Does it go over 11 now? That's interesting. I'll have to check that out. So, first one of the day, daily quest, cool, cool, cool. And all those, alright, that was like a, about 15 minutes. So, that's going to be it for the episode. Um, like the video if you enjoyed, subscribe for more content. I don't really know how often the content is going to come. Like I said, I might show some of those Minecraft things in the Minecraft Realm server. I don't know. And if I start playing different games, like I'm also really excited for games like Battlefront that are coming out. So, just. Please stay tuned, and I'll see you next time.